It's gonna be a full house here tomorrow night. It's a rivalry game. Is there a little extra juice or excitement for this one? Uh, very much so. It's UCLA versus USC, so there's always excitement. Uh, it's a battle for LA, uh, cross town showdown, you know, every name can they go for it. Um, this is gonna be exciting. I can't wait to play in it for the actual crowd this time. Uh, last year we played it, it was just live very gym, so I mean, actual fans, so I can't wait to play. Going through it last year, even though it was a different season without the fans, did you learn anything about the rivalry? Uh, no, not really. I mean, it's like another game to me. It didn't really feel like a rivalry. Uh, only thing I did change is Coach Infield was yelling more than usual. <laughs> uh, and that, though, was a regular game to me. But uh, this this year, I hope I get to learn a little bit more about it and just experience it more for myself and it's all its capacity. Both teams are ranked. Uh, what stands out to you about the matchup with them? Uh, I mean, they had the same team last year. Uh, they added one person. It was like the rest of the roster is pretty much the same through and through. Um, so I think it's going to be just got to call the game plan and sex you what we got to do and just worry about ourselves and not worry about them. So, yeah. Can, can you draw confidence from having beaten them like you did last year, or is that just totally in the past? Uh, to me, it's in the past. Uh, uh, like my dad says, it's not what about you did for me last time. It's what you do for me right now. Um, so I got to come with that mentality of, like, this is what they worry about right now in the present. They worry about what happened last year, the year before that, the year before that. All that's in the past. It's history. You can't, you can't rewrite that. But you, what you're going to do is control what's going to be in front of you. So that's what I'm worried about right now. What was the adjustment not having Isaiah out there last game? And uh, I know he's going to be a game time decision tomorrow, but how much does it change things when he's not on the floor? Um, it's a little different. Uh, we're not kind of like something that's just adjust and get better at. Um, he obviously, he's our best player. I mean, he's, he's, he's us in every category, so it was a little different not having him out there. But, I mean, it's a team sport, not an industry sport. So, I mean, I feel we'll be fine with or without him. We love him out there, obviously, but he's not out there. We just have to do what we do best and just go out there and play our game. Have you seen him trying to work back from that injury? I'm sure it's been a painful one for him. Uh, yeah, uh, I think he's taking it slow, just taking the necessary precautions he needs to take just to get back ready. So I know he'll be ready when he gets back, whenever that may be. Awesome.